If you're renting your home to large groups of people traveling together, there are a few things to keep in mind when preparing your home. Large groups often consist of extended families with more than one set of adults, so add an additional suite within a suite if possible. A large room can be transformed into a self-contained suite. Add two chairs to create a seating area in one corner of the room. Built-in shelves can be transformed into a kitchenette, complete with a mini fridge, coffee maker, and kettle. Grandma and grandpa can retire early and have breakfast even earlier without being disturbed. Large groups will wear down carpeting much faster, so avoid wall-to-wall -wall carpeting when you can. Replacing all that carpet with hardwood can be expensive, so I suggest using small area rugs instead. It's okay to place them over existing carpet. Place area rugs in high traffic areas like hallways or in front of doors. They protect the carpet underneath and can be removed for cleaning or replaced much easier. One common mistake people make when furnishing a home for large groups is buying large furniture. It's important to have seating for everyone, but opt for smaller pieces that take up less floor space and are far more versatile. And finally, I can't overstate the importance of buying good quality paint. With a lot of people moving through your home, your walls and cabinetry will get dirty and scuffed much quicker. Good quality paint will stand up much better and can be scrubbed down, saving you the time and money of a new paint job. Keep these tips in mind and your property will be the perfect retreat for extended families, multiple families, and even business groups.